that a lot of the heat that he catches, like what what's your take on that? Because we've had some ups and downs with Derek Carr. He left, you know, we played in Oakland, helped usher in the Vegas. Then he went on, like I said, magical run in 2021. And, and mm -hmm. he did some things with some weapons that not a lot of guys would have been able to work with that. You know what I'm saying? Let's just keep it above. Like yeah. I, we're hard on DC a bunch of times. I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it at all. No, absolutely. But there's been times where he's showed greatness. And I think a lot of us get us so upset with him because we see the glimmer, like, oh my yeah. God, he can be that guy. In 2016, this guy was a dark horse MVP candidate. We went 12 and four. If he mm -hmm. didn't break his leg, we could have won a Super Bowl, right? Yeah. It, it just year in and year out, it was just so many ups and downs. And I, I know the different coordinators, the different head coaches and all that good stuff. But what, what's your complete take as him as a leader and just him on the football field as a whole? My, my bad way. So I know you. Yeah, yeah, that. Man, I, I love DC, you know what I'm saying, as a, as a, as a person. And I thought he was a great player. Um, sometimes I don't think some of the the criticism he get is warranted because it ain't always all on him. You know what I'm saying? And I'm sure y'all know that too. But um, my fans and everybody, but, you know, is a it, when you to take that role, man. You take that role as the face of the franchise and the leader of the team. That's what come with it. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I can't think of a another player in the NFL who been in the role that he was in who ain't had to deal with that. You know what I'm saying? Like no matter what the reason we winning or losing, like you know you the guy. You know what I'm saying? You the one who need who who got an answer to it. You feel me? At the end of the yeah. day. So, you know, like it, whether he wanted it or not, you know what I'm saying? Hell, you the, you the face of the franchise. So, you know, it, it's warranted in a way because yeah. that, you know what I'm saying? Like, heavy is the head that wears the crown. Good. Yes. Yeah. I mean, that's why you get paid the big bucks. You know what and I'm saying? You get paid the big bucks to talk through the tough situations, talk after the tough losses, talk after the big wins. You get paid the big bucks, man. So, yeah, you, the criticism going to come in. You know what I'm saying? Even if everybody don't feel like it was warranted, but like, I feel like DC a hell of a quarterback. You know what I'm saying? NFL, I really do. And they ain't just that's because I was there in 2016 when he broke his leg. And hell, we watched, we used to watch film on the Raiders a lot in 2016 uh, when I was 